for you the six months delay, it's it doesn't make sense. Uh, no, and, and, and frankly, I don't understand why they insist so much on it, because it is not that particular measure won't do anything to promote and protect the French language. Uh, it really is, to me, it, it is a mystery why they went with that. I mean, and there's a whole range of, of measures like that in, in, in 96 that are not really, in my opinion, useful. So why, you know, like little annoyances, but annoyances that become um, problematic. A way more stress on your parents, for yes, example. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. Yes. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, and 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 again, as as Andre pointed out, when when we arrived, uh, my father and my mother they didn't have time to go to school to learn the language. They have to work. They have to pay. We, we have to pay the rent. We have to <laughs> pay the, the the groceries. You know, and the kids, my brothers and sisters. I'm I'm the eldest, so uh, I also you know work. So, First, the first things first. We need we need to survive, and not just survive, but to uh, make sure we, we can have a better life than, than what we had before. So, well, learning a language in, in a formal setting um, is perhaps not the first priority of the recently arrived immigrants. Why it took so long for the liberals to speak out against Bill Ninety Six? Why you haven't come up earlier about your own? personal and family history about uh, this uh, six-month delay, why the Liberals took time, too much time, to have a firm position on Bill 96? Um, well, <laughs> Andre. <laughs> well, this is, a, this is a bill that has over 200 articles. Uh, it was studied at clause by clause for months and months, and it did take time for a lot of these articles to come out and for people to really understand what this bill means, uh, but the reaction from the community, the reaction from uh, from the immigrant community, the reaction from francophones who realized, okay, we may not have access to uh, an anglophone sejep anymore, um, is uh, is quite straightforward and quite honest and quite direct. And uh, so, once that bill has been studied, once we understand, once everybody understood uh, all of the repercussions, it became uh, it became plainly obvious to, to us and to everyone else that this bill uh, does not accomplish what it sets out to accomplish, and has a lot of clauses that are very problematic for a lot of people. 